Hello and welcome to another show and tell. This time it's about a book called One Hour War Games. Practical Tabletop Battles for Those with Limited Time and Space by Neil Thomas. Uh, and published by Pen and Sword Military. So this is a game uh, this is a book that I uh, was on the lookout for some time and I finally got this uh, 2021 printing uh, I heard uh, good things about it that's a nice picture on it you know, Soviet KV-1 with uh, with uh, Soviet infantry um, because I do have a limited time on my uh, for my uh, <laughs> wargaming needs and uh, limited space, and uh, I was very interested in uh, uh, this book because it promised uh, something for uh, uh, for my itch. The book is uh, 157 pages without the room for notes. Uh, it's uh, structured in uh, in uh, 22 chapters with two appendixes, appendices, um, and uh, the no, the first one, the first chapter is about the, why is this a book, uh, why was it made, and uh, uh, the uh, expected audience of it and uh, stuff like that. And then there are uh, uh, 18 chapters, I believe, dealing with particular uh, eras and wargaming that particular eras. And each era has two chapters for it. So uh, ancient wargaming uh, and the rules for ancient wargaming. So the peculiarities for each era and then uh, the uh, the rules for each era, uh, Dark Age, and they usually the chapter is two or three pages. Each chapter has two or three pages. The Dark Ages have uh, three pages, and uh, the war game for that period has uh, three pages as well. So then we have medieval with war gaming, then pack and shot, war gaming with uh, rules, horse and musket. Wargaming and, hor and horse and horse get uh, rules, rifle and saber, American Civil War, which has a distinct uh, chapter, uh, albeit uh, with uh, uh, shorter uh, with shorter rules, only two pages, Machine Age. Uh, 1900 to 1939 with the rules Second World War with the uh, rules and then from uh, chapter uh, 20 uh, and beyond uh, there are a number of scenarios uh, so we have uh, so now this is <laughs> this is a chapter twenty. So all, the, all of all of these scenarios are in the chapter twenty. So we have pitch battle uh, one and two, control the river, take the high ground, bridgehead, flank attack one, flank attack two, melee, double delaying action, late arrivals, surprise attack, an unfortunate oversight, escape. Static defense, fortified defense, advance guard, encounter, counter attack, blow from the rear, fighting retreat, twin objectives, ambush, defense in depth, bottleneck, infiltration, triple line, disorder defense, botched relief, shambolic command, last stand, each with uh, some schematic um, map uh, that's suitable for a uh, Three, three feet by three feet uh, gaming table which can be found in uh, practically every house, household then chapter 21 it's about campaigns and chapter 22 is about solo wargaming which is a must in uh, in uh, today's world then some background reading 
about uh, war games, which is always nice. Some of them, I, uh, some of the books I have, and then some uh, military history books. Uh, again, some of them uh, I had or read. Um, so yeah, all in all, and then we have uh, uh, useful addresses for magazines, military book supplies, uh, model figure manufacturers, because uh, it's mainly about uh, uh, miniature wargaming, plastic figures, stockists, stockists, painted figures, stockists, and wargame terrain manufacturers, and then an index for uh, the book and the notes. You can write, if you're a barbarian, you can write stuff in the book. Um, so yeah, all in all, I like the I like the find I like the uh, uh, the purchase. Uh, looking forward to reading it and uh, thoroughly and uh, playing uh, scenarios or campaigns using this. Uh, th thank you for watching, and uh, till next time. Uh, goodbye.